Welcome to the Defeating Epilepsy Foundation YouTube channel. At the Defeating Epilepsy Foundation, our mission is to provide the advocacy and educational resources needed to the epilepsy community and our society. We are dedicated to removing the stigma associated with epilepsy and help to create opportunities for individuals battling epilepsy. In this presentation, we will discuss what atonic seizures are, symptoms of atonic seizures, what to do if someone has an atonic seizure, and treatments for atonic seizures. An atonic seizure, also known as a drop seizure, causes a sudden loss of muscle strength. A tonic means a loss of muscle tone. A person experiencing an atonic seizure may become limp, drop to the ground, and usually remains conscious. These seizures occur without warning and can result in injury. Atonic seizures last on average no longer than 15 seconds. There are two types of atonic seizures, generalized onset and focal onset. Atonic seizures can cause part or all of the body to go limp. The person can suddenly fall to the ground. Other symptoms include slumping of the head or upper body, drooping eyelids, head nods, body jerking, and partial consciousness. In some children, the only symptom is that the head drops suddenly. There are two types of atonic seizures, generalized and focal. Generalized onset atonic seizures are the most common type of atonic seizure. Generalized affects both sides of the brain. Generalized atonic seizures begin with a loss of muscle tone, resulting in a drop in the head, legs, or entire body. The person experiencing the seizures is usually not fully aware of what is taking place. Focal motor atonic seizures start in only one part of the brain. They result in a loss of tone in only one part or side of the body. Atonic seizures usually appear in childhood and may or may not last into adulthood. Atonic seizures are most often observed in people with Lennox-Gastaut syndrome or Dravet syndrome. It is important to remember that one person may experience multiple different types of seizures. When someone is having an atonic seizure, they may have several seizures in a row. It is important to make sure the person is safe and prevent them from becoming injured. If they fall, lie them on their side and put a folded blanket or piece of clothing under their head to prevent injury. Move any objects away that can cause them harm. It is common for the person to feel confused or upset, so show compassion and assure them that they are safe. If a person has an atonic seizure and sustains injury, seek medical attention if necessary. When recovering from an atonic seizure, the person may feel tired, so stay with them as they recover. Patients with chronic atonic seizures may be advised by their physician to wear a helmet to prevent head injury. Anti-seizure medications are the most common and effective treatment. Common medications include ethosuximide, valproic acid, lamictadine, and cabalism. If there is no response to medication, the keto diet, a high-fat, low-carbohydrate diet may be used to reduce seizure activity. A VNS may also be implanted to reduce seizures by sending electrical energy through the vagus nerve to the brain. To learn more about atonic seizures, please check out our resources used in the presentation today.
Like and follow us on our social media pages and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for your support and together we will defeat epilepsy.